Hello guys and welcome to another episode of our devotional series which is entitled The Weary World Rejoices and this is our day 4 and this is entitled Shepherds. So we will be talking about those shepherds na nagdala ng nagpakalat ng magandang balita tungkol sa kapanganakan ni Jesus Christ. And um, imagine na ikaw ay naglalakad sa isang remote beach in the middle of the night walking along the soft and cool sand of uh, the beach and your eyes might need to adjust dahil sa napakadilim doon sa beach na yon dahil walang street lights no lamps no flashlights and then when you look at the sky and then you begin to wonder and you stand there in awe no, mesmerized by the beauty and the clear and the clarity of the numerous stars. At dahil walang artificial light, no, the, the, those stars, they seem brighter and clearer than you've ever seen them. And sometimes, it takes a very dark or it takes being in a total darkness to see the light that's been around us the whole time. And what had been distant is now startlingly clear. You know, sometimes, makikita natin yung liwanag pag sobra tayong napalibutan ng kadiliman. Now imagine those shepherds na nasa gitna ng parang standing in total darkness that night na dumating yung angel sa kanila at ipahayag yung magandang balita. And probably, yung iba inaantok pa sa kanila while they are scanning no, yung lugar para uh, makita yung mga predators na maaaring umatake sa kanilang pinapastol na tupa. And yung mga mata, mga mata nila, they are also adjusting no, doon sa pitch blackness. And with only the night sky, as their source of light. And the scripture says that when an angel appeared, the glory of the Lord shone around the shepherd. And that is in Luke chapter 2, verse 9. Instantly, the shepherds were terrified. Dahil between the angels, them, the shepherds, and the brilliant light of God's glory, it is really understandable for them to be terrified dahil bigla na lang na nagpakita sa kanila yung mga anghel. And typically, this um, unclean outcast, as yun yung tawag sa mga shepherds during that time, they are being kept away from the society dahil doon sa status ng kanilang pamumuhay. But then that night, suddenly, they were in the spotlight. Biglang sila yung naging sentro no nung, nung gabi na yun, and they were seen and they, probably they never expected na sila yung pagsasabihan tungkol sa napakagandang balita ng kapanganakan ni Jesus Christ or even um, God would use them to declare the arrival of the Lamb of God and dito sa devotional series natin, mahikita natin that God spoke to unlikely people. Number one is Mary. Um, sabi nga, she is a lowly virgin girl. And then Joseph, a tradesman, na engaged, no, na makapangasawa ni Mary. And this untouchable shepherds. And these unlikely people were to become God's messenger in the most unexpected ways. And years later, more unlikely people at that time, women, were chosen to become or to deliver the news about Jesus had been resurrected. And you might feel like an unlikely candidate but God can use you to declare the Savior this Christmas season. And God can use you to become that bright light that breaks through a weary and dark world. 
So for the, to this uh, for this Christmas season, kung akala natin na um, wala tayong purpose ngayon dahil nasa gitna tayo ng um, pandemic, let us not forget that God God can definitely use us to become a light to someone else's sky, no? especially if that uh, sky is dark, no? Pag do habang na dumadaan sila sa napakadilim na um, higto ng kanilang buhay. Dahil nga, nasa gitna tayo ng uh, pandemic, napakaraming sakon na, ano, napakaraming um, hindi magandang bagay na nangyayari sa atin ngayong taon na to. So, let us become that um, shining light to other people and let us become a blessing to them this Christmas season. And let me end this video with a Bible verse from Luke chapter 2, verses 15 to 20. It came to pass, as the angels were gone away from them into heaven, the shepherds said one to another, Let us now go even unto Bethlehem, and see this thing which is come to pass, which the Lord hath made known to us. And they came with haste, and found Mary and Joseph and the babe lying in the manger. And when they had seen it, they made known abroad the saying which was told them concerning this child. And all they that heard it wondered at those things which were told them by the shepherds. But Mary kept all these things and pondered them in her heart. And the shepherds returned glorifying and praising God for all the things that they had heard and seen, as it was told unto them. So stay blessed, stay safe, and have a wonderful day.